start with um, a sugar cookie mix in our mixer. And I do have a cord today. I stole it from the vacuum. So hopefully nobody will be vacuuming tonight. Yeah, I should have gotten that. But it was easier to steal it from the vacuum. And we still have our Christmas tree lit, okay. So we've got our sugar cookie mix here. And to that, we're gonna add um, half a cup of butter, which is one stick. I listed all the butter together so you knew how much um, to get all together, but we're gonna split it up. So we're gonna use half a stick here, or uh, half a cup here, which is a whole stick. Uh, we're gonna use some lemon rind. And this gives it some, just a little bit extra flavor here. And you can really taste this when the cookie's all done. And I think this is a good thing to add to your cookie trays too. And you know, hostess gifts, whatever. Okay, so we've got our cookie mix, our butter, our lemon peel, and our egg. It cut real nice when I was cutting them. All right, we're gonna mix that up. Along what? It's the, yeah. They're all on there. Mm-hmm. From the very beginning. Till Jesus comes. Okay, so I'm just gonna press this in. I always like to use foil in the pan so I can lift it out, make it easier to cut. I can smell that lemon in here. have one little corner that's there we go all right we're gonna bake this for a couple minutes so it doesn't get real soggy okay bake that. finished working with this we're gonna take some chopped walnuts This is the, the nutty part, uh, the baklava. Okay, so I've got walnuts. We've got a little bit of sugar here. We've got some honey, right? No, no honey. Walnut sugar, a quarter cup of butter. So we've used a half, now we're using a quarter, so all we have is left is the two tablespoons. And the, um, cinnamon and brown sugar, which is a teaspoon of cinnamon, and no brown sugar, brown sugar goes to that. Okay, teaspoon of cinnamon, and a little salt. Put up salt. And a little bit of salt. Is what? You with me? We've got the um, the nuts, the, the third of a cup of sugar, the uh, teaspoon of cinnamon, the eighth of a teaspoon of salt. And we're going to mix that up. And have this ready for when that comes out. It takes a little doing, but it does all incorporate. Make 
it nice and crumbly. Okay. We'll just go ahead and set this aside while this is baking. That's ready to go on the crust when that's ready. Okay. This could be done a little bit more. Okay, we'll turn that off. This could be done a little bit more, but for time's sake, we'll just go with it. All right. We're going to take our walnut mixture and just kind of crumble that on here. These are our baklava bars. And I think your friends are gonna be really impressed with this. And did I? In this? I haven't finished yet. I know, she's really after me tonight. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We haven't gotten that far, I don't think, for the. Okay. Uh, there's our walnut mixture on there. Okay, then we're going to. I don't know, I'm all discombobulated now. Okay. That's the wrong recipe. Let me just look at this here. Okay. All right, now, here's our fo frozen shells. I'm going to take eight of these, comes in 15, and just crump them over the top. So that gives us the, the baklava taste. It is. Okay, now we're going to stick this back in the oven. Okay. Maybe, ouch. Okay. We'll stick that back in the oven, and then when um, it comes out, we're going to melt this butter with our honey and a little bit of brown sugar and cinnamon, and we may need some teaspoon of vanilla in that. So we'll bring that over here for now, so I remember. All right. I'll stick this in the microwave for a minute. Oh, our cinnamon. And put our cinnamon in here and brown sugar. Okay. Now, put it there. I could not believe that. Okay, I'll stir that up. I did, unfortunately, but that's too crazy. Okay, we're going to put a little bit of lemon juice in here. Half a teaspoon. Good. And a teaspoon of vanilla. Just a little. No, and this one has no seeds. Remember the seed problem we had the, the other week? When I cut that lemon, I'm like, oh no. Okay, we'll pull these out. So you can see what we do. We're just gonna take this and drizzle this over here and let it cool. There is our baklava bars. You'll see them.